Yo, hello, it's Povika from Editing Visuals here, and before we start the video, I need to tell you guys about my newest opium presets pack that includes opium glitches, opium texts, and opium effects, and if you want to scan cars in type of style, then you should probably check this pack out, but anyways, let's begin. So the first thing we're gonna make is the whole effect, it's gonna be sort of like grungy opium effect, so what you can do is press on your clip and press Control D, and now we can start adding effects to this layer right here. So the first effect I like to add here is noise. Uncheck use color noise and make the amount of noise to 64%. Now I actually like to add a plugin, which is deep glow. Now you don't need this, by the way. Uh, you can add like glow or a lot of glows and just mess around here. Or if you have different glows, then they work fine just well. But I think deep glow is the best glow. So I like to make the radius of deep glow to 572. And now we can add levels, add it on top of deep glow. And I like to make the input black to 102 and the output white to 500. 80.4 and now we can add s flicker and i like to make the amplitude higher so like 0.3 somewhere like there and now if you're like okay what is this this does not look good don't worry guys there's one more thing i actually need to do which is to right click on your clip go to blending mode and here you can make it to overlay and now look how this looks this is how it looked before and after it just gives that grungy vibe also this glow look how the glow impacts this it's a really cool impact so i really recommend to have deep glow or just add other glows and mess around like crazy uh you can save this as a preset if you want so you can like press ctrl a and go to animation save animation preset now here are some opium presets from the pack but i'm just gonna name this to like let's say opium mode overlay and you can do this for an any clip it's gonna look pretty cool okay i'm not gonna lie this looks the best on clips that are like darker and now i'm gonna show you how to make these sick transitions that you saw in the intro so one thing you can do is like you see it transitions from one clip to the other and the other clip just starts here so we can actually cut it like by pressing ctrl shift d and we can add the preset we just made so opium mode overlay we're gonna change it a bit so we're actually going to right click here and we're gonna make the blending mode to screen so this is the type of effect you will get you can see black tiles right here but there are no black tiles here so i'm just gonna add motion tile on top of everything so yeah i'm just gonna add motion tile on an adjustment layer that's on top of everything and i'm gonna make the output width to like 80 just to be safe all right and you can see this looks very cool this is like a really cool way to transition between two clips like like that uh, you can add like invert so like for example like you can press ctrl alt y cut it up to one frame and you can add invert and it's gonna be like this so you can add it like on one frame like that it's gonna make up for a super cool transition and for other clips you would just need to like press ctrl d and then go to opium mode overlay right click on it blending mode overlay and for this transition i picked out like a really cool part from this music video this music video is the ken carson uh, i think rock and roll they had like these cool little glitches but you don't need these cool glitches by the way because we just did a transition like this but with these cool glitches i actually found a really cool way to transition which i had in the intro of the video as you saw like those black and white transitions sort of so for those transitions i actually use a preset from my opium presets pack so if you have the opium presets pack you can type like opium free for this one and this is how it will look but what i like to do now is i like to add deep glow below every effect the only difference i like to do with the deep glow is i make it to 250 on the radius and now i'm going to right click on this clip go to blending mode and i'll make it to screen and this will be a super cool transition like this it goes like that i mean i don't know if i've ever seen a cooler transition than this <laughs> you guys have to like let me know if there's a better transition than that okay there probably is i'm joking and yeah i tested out a lot of these opium presets and just did the same method like screen them and just use it as transition and they looked so well like opium 4 was working very well for example okay i'm gonna add like opium 4 this time and i'm going to right click on it blending mode and make it to screen and now i'm gonna add deep glow again and here i'm gonna make the radius to 250 this one looks super cool as well i still think for this one my favorite one that i found was still opium free so i'm just gonna keep it like this and don't forget to add deep glow below and make the radius to 250 or lower i'm not sure like as you can see this one's a bit too bright but it's still very cool like that's such a cool transition to have in your video and i need to let you guys know that i have a five dollar discount code for the opium presets pack which is code povicas that's about it guys really mess around a lot with the style if you guys have any questions then please let me know all right guys it was fun have a fun and productive day see you